we are moving on to an animated representation to show that motion is relative. Adu maathra valla, to study the two different types of frame of reference. Edakki aana, one is inertial frame of reference and the other one is non-inertial frame of reference. Apo namukha animated presentation ondhu kandalo, ondhu nokhi ke, you can see a person who is walking over a ground. Adu namu ulil aar ondhu, or aeroplane ondhu, it is also moving. Adu nula aa concepts um, adu nia immediate surroundings um, ellam ondhu view chayi dhe. And after that, we can move on to the two different types of frames of reference. Okay. But now come, the first one is inertial frame of reference. When the inertial frame of reference in the chodhi chaal, the frame of reference which is at rest or in a constant velocity with respect to its chosen scenario. But chosen scenario in the chunyal and the immediate surrounding, namala parayinu dhu bole, arbitrarily chosen surrounding. That's why we chosen scenario on the day shi tiriki. But okay, the frame of reference which is at rest or in constant velocity. Constant velocity, constant velocity, we can say that the body is in a uniform motion. Clear? That's all. It should be in a state of rest. That's it. Rest is in the surrounding, it could be considered as an inertial frame of reference. Then, the person is moving in the ground. Not walking, not walking, it's not on the ground. Then, the immediate surrounding, rest is in the ground, rest is in the ground, rest is in the ground. The immediate surrounding is simple. It is a tree. It is a ground. The ground is in the state of rest. Then, we say they are inertial frame of references. Clear or no? That's not true. We have to look at the state of rest. We have to look at the equation. F is equal to M A. What is Newton's second law of motion? Likewise, Newton's laws of motion all obey the initial frames of reference. Clear or no? Initial frames of reference obey Newton's laws of motion. Newton's second law of reality. We have to look at F is equal to m into a, f is equal to m into a. விடைப் பரண்சிரிக்கின்னும் it is in a state of rest or constant velocity which means acceleration is equal to zero. அப்பது நோக்கு இமக்கலை, இவ்விடை acceleration zero அனக்கில் f is equal to எந்தா இருக்கும் zero வாயிருக்கும். அதா, இது external force is equal to zero வாயிருக்கும். அதா, இது inertial frame of referenceகளில் external force என்தியின்னில்லா, act செய்யின்னில்லா. அதான் நம்லைடுக்கந்த consideration and that's why we called it as in a state of rest or constant velocity. State of, அல்லங்கள் external force is zero ஆனங்கள் velocity எப்போடும் வந்தாயிருக்கும் constant ஆயிருக்கும். அல்லான் அந்தும் பரையந்து inertial frame of reference. அப்பு இவ்விடத்த inertial frame of reference என்தான் ground on. And the second one is non-inertial frame of reference. The frame of reference which is accelerated with respect to scene under consideration. அதாயது, நம்மல் பரையிருக்கிறேன் இது நார்யுயில் accelerate ஜீதும் ஒன்று போடிகான். அது நீ நமக்கு எந்தாய்டு கண்சிடரு ஜியாம். இந்தானு immediate surrounding ஐட்டு கண்சிடரு ஜியாம். அங்கனை உள்ள frame of reference இன்னை நம்மல் விளிக்கின்ன பேரானந்து ஒன்று பரைந்து non-inertial frame of reference. அப்பு நோக்கிக்கே, இவ்விடை non-inertial frame of reference ஐட்டு நம்மல் யாரி எடுக்காம். Is it the man? Is it the ground? Or is it the aeroplane? Clear. இந்தானு, aeroplane ஆனு, it is in accelerated motion. இல்லை, இய் aeroplane accelerated motion லானந்து இப் பேசன் மூவு செய்ந்ததாயிட்டு observe செய்யாம் கடியுவில்லோ. அப்பா, passenger இந்தை immediate surrounding ஏதான் aeroplane ஆனு. This aeroplane is accelerating. அப்பா, அதுந்தானு frame of reference ஆனு. Acceleration உண்டாயிது உண்டு, it could be called as non-inertial frame of reference. ஒர்த்து வேக்கண்ட காரியும் non-inertial frame of reference do not obey Newton's laws of motion. அதாயிது, அவ்விடை external force இன்னை நம்மலந்தியுந்து consider செய்யுந்து. அப்போம் very clear, simply நம்மலந்தியுது, வலரை clear ஐடு define செய்து, what is inertial frame of reference and what is non-inertial frame of reference.